Hey everyone, my name's Mike Sherry and I'm with Paul Sherry RVs. Today, I got the opportunity to show you a brand new 2021. This is a Forest River Cherokee 304BH. This is one of Cherokee's larger travel trailers. It's a three slide bunkhouse travel trailer. Weighs under, just under 8,500 pounds. So this is gonna be something that one of those new beefy half ton trucks can pull. Uh, or uh, if you have an older half ton, you're gonna to need closer to a three quarter ton truck to pull this. Comes standard with a power tongue jack. In fact, a lot of, uh, on this Cherokee product is going to come standard. I just uh, got through a process of selecting an additional brand for the dealership here. And uh, just looking at what the competition has to offer, no one that I could find offers so much standard at such a good price. Cherokee has more standard options and all together at the end of the day, what you write your check for is a lower price than anyone else I could find out there in the market. This does come with the juice pack, which is a 27 series battery, a solar panel up on the roof, a solar panel controller, a battery disconnect and a battery monitor. So on a bright, sunny, beautiful blue sky like today, we're actually making power off that 50 watt solar panel up on the roof. The Cherokee products come with a aerodynamic front end here. This is going to allow this trailer to cut down the road very nicely compared to the competition that still uses more of a square front end. This front end is three sheets of metal, top two sheets, and then the bottom sheet is a rock guard down here to protect the front end from any road debris that might flip up off the road. The sidewalls on it are full body paint, full body paint aluminum. Uh, you don't see a lot of decals and stickers on Cherokee products because Cherokees recognize those stickers and decals don't like to stay on very long, especially in the sun. After a couple years, they like to shrivel up and fall off. So what they've done is they've spent the extra money and painted the entire metal on this. Three slides, two of which are on this side, one on the door entry side. Uh, the Cherokee comes standard prep for a backup monitor and the travel rack is a standard option on this so this travel rack also match your optional spare tire uh, but that travel rack will flip down great spot for bicycles or maybe a portable generator or maybe totes of uh, other supplies that you need to go camping so just a little bit extra storage there for you. Cherokee also has the most robust outside kitchen that I've seen. And this particular one has the full outside kitchen. Notice the big deck lid. That's going to protect you on a rainy day if you're underneath here cooking. Or maybe grabbing a beverage out of this gigantic refrigerator. So this is a refrigerator and freezer. Freezer on the left. Refrigerator on the right. This is twice as big as what the competition is putting in their outside kitchen. Also, this outside kitchen features hot and cold water with a drain. Uh, you would think that would be standard on most products, but it's not. Cherokee it is. Portable ice maker as well. Uh, what Cherokee's done is they sent some of their team members out camping. They said, you know what? We always need ice. It'd be nice to have an ice maker in our camper. So they made that and uh, standard in all their outside kitchens. Uh, electricity here and then a light switch for your lights up there. And then this entire base here is made out of a, a metal type material. Uh, it comes with drawer there for our, your cooking utensils and extra storage stuff. And then a pull out two burner uh, gas range here. What's beautiful about it being made out of metal is I've seen in the past and they've done outside kitchens for eight or nine years now is they've typically been made out of wood and that wood when water gets on it is gonna swell up and not be very structurally sound anymore. So by having the, the metal type material for the, the construction base of the outside kitchen is just going to make that last a lot longer. Two axles on this trailer. Door entry here features the nice more ride secure steps. And again, this is the 304 BH Cherokee 2021 as well uh, by Forest River. And Forest River partners with KOA. And together, they have an initiative to fight cancer, particularly kids who have cancer. Uh, weighs 8470 is the actual dry weight as it sits here right now. All right, so as you walk in, slides right in front of us. You dinette has the couch, has the zebra blinds. Those go up and down really slick. I got them where they're light, letting in just a little bit of light. And you can adjust them to where they let in a lot of light or no light or all the way up for full light 
and all the way down for full privacy. So a lot of cool things on those blinds there. Uh, they work really slick and I think it's solved the blind problem that RVs have had for years. The Udynet is larger than what I've seen in a lot of different brands. A lot of different brands, you can only fit three people around their Udynet. This you can easily fit five, maybe six, depending if there's some kids involved, but you can get the, the family around to eat a meal, to play cards, to do that kind of thing. This trailer features an island that's because it has the opposing slides here. The sink is in the island. It has a sink cover on it, which I have shown now, for just a lot of usable countertop space. 10 cubic foot, 12 volt refrigerator right now, just running off battery power. It's fully working. 10 cubic foot, so the, the competition puts a seven cubic foot in the same spot. Uh, Cherokee has partnered with Furion, which is really an innovator in RV, uh, in the RV space and they developed this 12 volt refrigerator to pair with that solar panel up on the roof and the bigger battery uh, to really provide uh, an exceptional refrigerator. Microwave down low here. Stove is two burner or three burner gas sorry two burners outside and then their oven down there. It does have a drawer down here for pots and pans nice big deep drawer. Plenty of drawers there. Uh, the sink here is a single basin farm style sink. I love it. Stainless steel, black stainless steel. All right, as you walk in, there's some storage here behind these cabinets. Entry doors right here for some items that you may need. Maybe some baseball caps or beach bags, that kind of stuff. And then right here is where your TV is going to mount, right? The factory provides with the TV mount and the appropriate wiring's already in the, the ceiling, audio-visual cables, a coax. So this does have the free antenna up on the roof, so you'll be able to uh, tie in those free over-there channels. This is your battery monitor I mentioned, part of that juice pack. This is your control panel, lights, water heater controls, water pump controls, slide controls, awning controls, all right there. Heating and air conditioning controls right here. Just simply turn it on what mode, and that device will turn on, whether it's your furnace or your air conditioner. Uh, this here is your uh, radio. This will be AM, FM, Bluetooth uh, compatible there. All right, looking at the front of the trailer, right? We've got a couple options here. The door to the right is our bathroom. And this bathroom, this door here goes directly into the master bedroom, but that's not the only entrance. That's just an entrance from the master bedroom. Uh, comes with some hooks there for your bath towels. Has the big fan, whole bathroom fan, stool here. Room enough to get changed. Big sink, it's got the big sink. You can fit your hands in it, hot and cold water. And then the Cherokee comes with this shower surround. Comes with the glass doors here. Nice stand up shower, spots for your soaps and things like that. Walking out of the bathroom, making a right turn, looking at the front of the trailer again. We have our bedroom, it's a queen bed walk around all three sides of the bed with a lot of room even at the foot of the bed so you can get out of either side of the bed without disrupting your partner right there's also a spot up here on the wall to mount a television and the appropriate wiring both sides of the bed have power both usb power and normal electric nightstand here and wardrobes on both sides of the bed hanging closet rod Notice the mirror there so you can get dressed in here in the morning or evening as well. All right, coming back towards the back of the trailer now. Got a couple doors here. This door off to the, the left is actually a built-in pantry. A lot of storage there. And then the door off to the right is your bonus room. So this room, you can sleep, you know, four or five people back here. You have a bunk up here. You have a couch down here that comes into a bed. Um, you have a bunk right here and you have another bunk up there. All the bunks are this really nice teddy bear uh, mattress bunk series. So it's a hyperallergenic mattress. Uh, a lot of people like that. Kids with sensitive skin. It uh, shouldn't make them flare up in hives or anything like that. Uh, this bunk here, now it does flip up and hooks into the wall. And that'll allow you to sit on the couch without bumping your head. So that completes the walkthrough on this Cherokee. So if you have any questions, I'm going to post links below of our contact information, also current pricing and pictures and availability of this unit. 
check that out below as well. Uh, financing's available. Check that the link out below for more information on that. Uh, we're very technological, so you can do all this on our website. Uh, trade in. Uh, we want your trade. We can give you a value on your trade without ever seeing it. We just need you to fill out the form. that will post a link below. Uh, same with the finance application. So check all that out. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you find yourself in the store, hunt me down. Say hello.